Yo, what's going on, everybody? Welcome yourself back to another episode of my Pokemon Theta Emerald Nuzlocke series. Now, people, in the last episode, we went to Fallabor Town and as well as here, Petalburg, Petalburg, Petalburg City, and we took down both Flannery and Norman, so that was a pretty, like, that was a pretty good episode in terms of progress and things of that sort, but, uh, yeah. In terms of, like, teams, though, like, I didn't level grind or anything of that sort, because I feel we're probably a bit over-leveled or something along those lines. I don't know, I just feel like we're a bit ahead of the game in terms of leveling, so I didn't level grind or anything of that sort. But before I go over the team, just in case you haven't watched last episode, be sure to drop a like as well as answer the comment question of the day now. The team, people. So first off, we got Rango the Zoroark. With uh, Scratch, Fan Attack, Pursuit, and Fury Swipes, Jacob the Excadrill with Metal Claw, Horn Drill, Dig, and Rock Slide, Vile Viper the Dunsparce with Takedown, Pursuit, Rock Smash, and Ancient Power, Gareth the Mar Inferno with Fury Swipes, Mock Punch, Flame Wheel, and Bulk Up. I almost, I always, always think, I always think I'm on the last Pokemon, but I'm not. Anyways, Valen the Linoon with Headbutt, Round Eyes, Tail Whip, and Sand Attack. And last but not least, Pastel the Marsh Stomp with Rock Slide, Mud Bomb, Water Gun, and Mud Slap. Now, if I get much use out of Gareth or Pastel this episode, they're most likely going to evolve, and I kind of really do want that to happen, because then our, then our whole team is going to be fully evolved, but uh, I guess we'll have to wait and see now. I believe, uh, let me check the, the little pokey nav, Hoenn map. I'm trying to remember where we got to head. We got to head all the way to Bauville City. So I guess I'll see you guys there in a moment. Okay, people, we are here in Mauville, so what do you got to say? Oh, Luna, you look like you have a lot of zip. It's a good thing. Wahaha, <laughs> fine. I've decided I need a favor. Mauville City has an underground sector called New Mauville. And I'd like you to go there and switch off the generator. The generator's been running f a bit haywire. It's getting a bit unsafe. Here, take the key to New... Uh, okay. How do we get there, then? Don't worry about it, blah, 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 is just Route 110? Wait, 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 wait. Where is that? Oh, okay. I thought it was gonna be God knows where, so... Where did you say? Where? Blah, blah, blah. A short surf away from Route 110. Okay, okay, okay. I get you. I get you now. So, I'm assuming it's from here? Yes. I probably want to put up a repel if I have any. I... Do I think? Do I have anything more than regular repels? Yes, I have super repels. Thank you. What's this? Oh, it's just a stupid secret base thing. Oh, here it is. That was gonna be somewhere completely different, but nope, here it is. Okay. Door is locked. Use the basement key. Yes, okay. So what do we... Oh, boy, this is gonna be fun. Hmm. What do I have in the front? Okay, okay. I'm gonna keep Valen in the front. Can we continue on without pressing that switch? Probably. Or er, not okay. This is gonna be a ball of fun, isn't it? I have a feeling there's just gonna be like some complicated puzzle throughout here, but at the same time, I have a feeling that's probably also not the case. I don't know, I guess we'll have to wait and see, but... Hey man, I'm just getting as many items as I can right now. Are there encounters in here? Yes, there are, and you know what? I'm actually gonna try and get myself one here. I killed it. A critical hit! Of course, of course, of course, of course. I would get a critical hit when I actually want to get an encounter for once. Thank you, game. Okay. This place doesn't... Ooh. Ah, uh, dang it, I thought... Oh! Oh, it's not... It's not a strength rock. I thought it would be... I thought we'd be able to move it once we, like... Um, once we finally, like... Got strength and everything. But no, okay. So those rocks aren't actually, like, they just straight up aren't, um, they aren't strength rocks whatsoever. I thought they were. I honestly got thought that's what they were and that was it, but nope. Completely wrong. Okay. We got a lot of switches around here, but, uh, it doesn't seem all too complicated. Okay. We're off. I'm just gonna battle these guys, because why not, dude? It's free XP. It's not bad either. You know, I'm trying to get Valen up, uh, pretty decently in terms of attacks and everything. Although I kind of wish Valen would get something other than normal type moves, even though I probably have some moves I can teach him still. There's so many here. I really want to know what those do, but okay. As for the generator, I'm assuming. Yep. And of course we encounter a Pokemon right then and there. Whatever. Hello. Thunderstone. 
That's pretty useless, but hey, man. That was a lot quicker than I expected it to be, so let's just get out of here, I guess? I don't know. I have a feeling there's much more to this place, but that's that's just me being suspicious, probably. I think we can just head on over here and we can... Nope, I have to press the green switch. Oh, wait. Do I have to go a long way? Do I have to? No, I don't. Okay, there we are. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're fine. I thought I would have to just go all the way along and just go through some long and stupid process, but nope. Just gotta press that switch and now we can just head on back. You know, to be honest, I thought this was gonna be a lot more complicated and longer than it really was. We just, we, we just basically found it by accident. Just walked in, boom, there we are, we're good. So let's just talk to Watson, I guess, and he'll probably say something. Hello. Wah ha ha, I knew it, Luna. I knew I'd made the right choice asking you. This is my thanks, a mock bike from Rido. Go on, you earned it, okay. That, that's it? That wasn't worth it. <laughs> that was not worth it. Well, here we go, we finally have a new route, and, um, I believe this is where we gotta go, so we'll be getting an encounter on this route, for once. Because I know I have missed out on a couple encounters and things of that sort, as well, we just haven't really been getting many encounters to begin with, so I haven't really been able to do so. But now we're finally gonna be able to do that, that's gonna be great, you know? Even though our team is pretty good in terms of levels and everything, you can never be too sure, because for all we know, some Pokémon may just come out of nowhere and, um... You know, take one down randomly or something, or maybe they have one of those, like, one-hit KO- I went into the Pokemon Center. Or maybe they just have a one-hit KO move, you know? You never know! So it's always best to have, like, uh, spare Pokemon in the PC, just in case things of that sort happen. Luckily, we've been... Yeah, pretty lucky. I mean, we only lost Pokemon during... Of course you would turn. We only lost Pokemon during, uh, what's this phase? Brawly's battle, and that was it. That was literally the only battle where we really lost much of anything. Aside from that, we are perfectly fine. We have no issue with anything. We're fine. We are on good levels. We have good type coverage. All things of that sort. Hold up. Can we get a Carvana or something? Please? Or something, obviously. But what is it? It is a... Really? Basculin. Really? Out of everything we could have possibly gotten. Can we just catch you with the Pokeball? Uh, no, we can't. Come on. I don't want to attack you. I really don't. You're going to kill me, but okay, let's see. Fine, we'll go into Rango and just go for Scratch. Another one. Okay, now we'll throw an Ultra Ball. Why are you so difficult to catch? Oh god, you are actually doing damage. That's what scares me the most. Alright, let's go for a Super Potion. And let's just keep going for the Pokeballs we're throwing. Come on. Why are you so difficult to catch? in the world? Is, is this normal? I am I am actually afraid as to why we're not killing you or not, not killing you. Why have why we haven't caught you yet? Like what? I swear to god. Is our like one and only There we go. I was going to say is our one and only encounter in god knows how long just going to be uh, na nothing. I don't even uh, I don't even know what to name you to be honest. Let's see. Let me pull up the name list. I always forget to pull this up. I'm not even kidding. Just always. And we're going to name this after... Uh, let's see. Hopefully I don't mispronounce this. Hopefully it fits as well. Uh, hold up. It is a rather weird name, but I, I kind of like it. I'm going to assume it's Kaz Curdy. Kaz Curdy. Maybe it's Quaz? Curdy? Quirty? I don't- it's- it's very odd to say, I will say that right now. So if I mispronounce it, just simply correct me and we'll be good to go. I am bad at pronunciation to begin with, but it's just an odd name as well. So that's that. I'm gonna put Rango back in the fr- actually, no, I'm gonna keep failing here. Let's- see. oh, what- <sighs> stop talking to me. <laughs> I hate all the po- the people on, like, the Poke Knives. They're so annoying. They just call you at the most random and unopportune times. I forgot you are a part ghost type. Completely forgot. Carvana... Valen, please. Don't die as well. Thank you. Okay, let's see. What do we got around to? Oh, hi, Steven. Hi, Luna. It's me, Steven. We met in the cave near Dufort. Have you met many kinds of Pokemon since I last saw you? There are many, many kinds of Pokemon in this world... In this world with us. If you wanted to raise only your favorites, that's fine. Perhaps you find it more fun to raise all sorts of Pokemon. As a trainer of Pokemon, what do you think? 
Of course, it's not any of my business. It'd be nice if we were to meet again somewhere. Shut up, Steven. You're... That, that whole statement was just so everywhere. It was just like, geez, dude, can you just stop speaking? Thank you. Now, let's get a repel, though, because we already got an, our encounter, and I do not fancy more encounters. Thank you very much. I knew you were going to turn. I was like, okay, maybe we can just sneak by him, and we'll be perfectly fine. Oh. Hmm. All right, let me get out the hype. No, no, nah, that'd be yeah, that'd be really stupid to be honest. Why are you doing so much damage? What? There we go. It's stupid knocked out. Okay, now I'm gonna switch into Rango because in the world, we are not having much luck. I can very well see that. For some reason, we this episode has just been pure not good luck. Basically, we've just been horribly unlucky for some reason, and it's just it's it's just odd. It's very very odd. Um, do we have any awakenings? We probably do, and I might not just see it. Whatever. You know what? You know what? I'm just gonna survive. Oh! Well, I woke up that exact turn, so it didn't even matter. Okay, that would have just been a waste. Uh, now I'm gonna put Vile Viper in the front, because he has not gotten any use this episode, and, you know, he's the same level as, uh, both. Ooh, Citrus Berries! Dude, that's great! As I was saying, he is the same level as as, um, Rango and Valen, so why not? Okay. Oh, uh, we got a fun route ahead of us. Hopefully we can just sneak by a bunch of the trainers. I know there are quite a lot around here, but hopefully we can just sneak by them. I know I snuck by, uh, like, basically all the trainers here in my Omega Ruby and Alpha Sat, like, when I played that, but, um... Is that it? Oh, God. Um... Oh no, this is, uh, hello. I heard about a cave god. Can you heal me? No? Of course you won't. Are you, why do you have so many wingle in your home? Nope. Are you a trainer? No, you're not. Hello. Blah, blah, blah. But it turns out there's an HMU called Fly. I wish I Oh! So that's why there's all those in there. Okay, that makes not much sense. We'll just go on up here. There is more stuff. No, 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 no. I want to put up a repel. Okay, let's see... Oh! I see citrus berries. At least I think these are citrus berries. Yes, okay, dude. The citrus berries are actually a lot better than I anticipated. Like, dude, citrus berries. They are actually really useful. They're like orange berries, but better. Uh, let's go for the takedown. Why not? Oh, because you're gonna put me to sleep. That's why not. Oh my god, I hate you. Please just kill it. Thank you. Oh, and of course, now I gotta switch because you just happened to damage me so much. And I just realized how close they actually are to my level right now. Like, see what I meant? Like, that's that's one the big reason why I didn't necessarily level grind was because I already knew they were gonna sort of, like, be around my level, so why not? And plus, it's not like I'm horribly overleveled or something. I'm just very slightly overleveled, so it'd be kind of a waste to just simply overlevel that much. Nope, nope. Haha. -ha. No, you're gonna be that guy, I see. I see you. Let's just sneak by everybody, to be honest. Look at this. What do we got over here? We got an item. Sure, why not? Elixir! Hey, if I don't end up using it, I can at least sell it. Alright, don't. Do not. Do not. Haha. -ha. Oh, you are a trainer. Don't think I don't see you. We are just sneaking by, like, every single trainer today. I'm surprised. Oh, this should be fun. If there was an item out there. I want the item. Hello, guys. Hello. I was like, what happened? Like, we weren't getting the item for a second. So I was just like, did I do something wrong to the game or something? All right, let's see. What have we got in here? Um, we got grunts. Hello. Can I heal here? Please tell me I can. Yes. I was like, where am I going to heal up? We are getting kind of low on health and everything, so... There we go. I'm just going to keep Vi I'm just going to keep Vile Viper in the front. I'll just hope it goes well. Just... Yeah, ancient power went... Oh... What? What? Oh god, you are doing so much damage. I don't like this pursuit. Oh. Well, what do you know? Vile Viper, of course, somehow manages to beat Carvana. Okay. And uh, we can dodge you, apparently. But I kind of don't want to, just in case... Uh, the... Like, the admin we fight here, I think it's Shelly? Just in case they end up being a lot stronger than anticipated, you know? Oh my god, that was a lot of death. what? 
That was, uh, that was a tad bit unexpected. Let's go for the faint attack. Mm, Fury swipes, maybe? Nah, we'll, we'll just finish you off with faint attack. There we go. Okay, one last heal up at- wait, there's probably more grunts upstairs, to be honest, but still. I want to make sure our team is pretty healthy, you know? Oh, double battles. How I love double battles. What I've noticed about Theta Emerald, though, is that there's an increased amount of double battles. Like, there's so, 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 so many more. It's ridiculous. But I actually kind of like it, because it is a big change of pace, you know, from the usual, just like, God knows what. I am- I kind of made a mistake, because... Dude, if that girder attacks Vile Viper, or any of us, actually... Oh, God, why do I still have these guys in, actually? Uh, Pastel go out, and Gareth go out, because girder was a big threat. Oh, girder is a huge threat now. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to kill you right now. Smelling salt, really? Oh. <laughs> that could have been bad. All right, let's be careful, to be honest. I'm really afraid as to how this is going to go, but Pastel, please be fast enough. Yes, perfect. Dude, that girder could have easily killed us, to be honest. Okay, now we should have a relatively easy fight here, to be honest. I'm going to heal up Gareth just in case, though. You can, you can never be too sure, man. You can never be too sure. Alright, another rock slide, and then just go for the mock punch on the Poochiana. Why not? I don't care. I don't... <gasps> Gareth barely survived that. What? Mercury avoided it. Are you kidding me? I don't, I don't know how Gareth survived it, but hey man, I'm not going to question it whatsoever because he is alive and that's what matters. Oh my god, he just barely survived that though. Oh god. That is not a death I really wanted to see either because Gareth is basically right on the verge of evolving, so it's just like, that just wouldn't even be funny. I'm going to keep Vile Viper in the front just so he can keep getting the experience and everything because we need it. I think you are the last trainer we actually have to go to or fight. In specific. Oh, nope, nope, nope. There we go. Loud Dread. Ah, uh, whatever. I'm just gonna put Gareth in the front. Maybe he'll be able to get enough XP to evolve. I highly doubt it, but still. Drowsy, why did I keep you in? Oh, God. <laughs> you know, sometimes I really think through my attacks, and other times it's just like, what am I doing again? Like, I have no idea. Please let me heal up. I'm so glad they put this right here. We would be dead, basically, by now, if it weren't for that bed. Now, is that Shelly or... I don't... I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm gonna keep Vile wow, Viper in the front. Okay, hello. Ahaha, ah, you're gonna meddle in Team Aqua's affairs? You're either absolutely fearless, simply ignorant, or both. So cute, you're disgusting. I'll put you down, kitty. What? I'll have you know, I'm not a kitty. Is this Shelly? Yes, it is. Hello. I don't... They've written, like, the redesign for Shelly was insanely different. It's just, like... Jeez, it changed a lot. Um, let's try Ancient Power and see how that goes, to be honest. What are you doing? As I was saying, the redesign for, like, Shelly, Tabitha, all of those. She Shelly... Oh, I forget most of their names, to be honest. All I, rem all I remember is, uh, Shelly, Courtney, Tabitha. The only reason I remember Tabitha is because his redesign is, like, insanely different. He's, like, some chubby fat guy in the, um, in, like, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, which is odd. Very, very odd, especially when you consider how he looked in, like, these games. He was just some regular, like, Team team Magma grunt-looking guy, but... Eh, to be honest, I kind of do like it, though, because it actually makes them stand out from the rest, as opposed to in these games, where it's just, like, they're kind of sort of different from the, um, from, like, the admins and stuff, but nah, nah, nah not insanely. Ooh, you might actually be a bit scary. I don't know, I might want to go for a bulk up or two. Uh, no, I think I'm better off just going for the mock punches because from the looks of it, setting up could be a lot more riskier than just simply going for mock punch. Especially seeing as now I can actually take you out this turn unless you heal, which you don't because you are not anybody, basically. I'm, I'm really glad trainers like these don't heal up because if they were to, I'd be in a lot of trouble. Crock a rock. That is a job for Pastel. Pastel, how much XP do you need to level up? I think Pastel is going to be able to get the evolution here. If that is the case, this is going to be great. All right, Croc Rock, Croc Rock. I always, I always feel like I'm saying that name wrong, but no, 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 no. I said it right. I think, <laughs> probably, hopefully. All right, let's go for the Surf because I got rid. Oh, you're going to be like that. Okay, 
As I was gonna say, I got rid of Water Gun for Surf, for obvious reasons. Surf is probably the best HM move, to be honest, because it's not that bad of, like, a damaging move, first off. And secondly, you know, it actually has a lot of uses aside from... It actually has a lot of uses aside from being an HM move. For one, it's decently strong, as I said, but it also... Let's say you're in, like, a double battle or something like that. It's like, it'll damage technically all the opponents, but still. Ooh, I think it's time! I think it's time. I think we're gonna be getting the evolution right here, right now, unless I forgot. Yes! Here we go! Pastel is evolving! Oh, boy! And then... Ooh, bam! Look at that! Ooh! Like, I'm a big fan of Blaziken and all, but to be honest, Swampert is certainly my favorite of the Hoenn Trio, Final, Final Evolutions. Uh, we'll, we'll talk about that in a little bit. It's bad enough to have Team Magma blunder about, but now there's you! It makes you sniff around in our business anyway. We have a situation here! Let's see, Magma Mob just passed the Weather Institute. They appear to be headed for Mount Pyre! What?! We can't waste any more time here, we have to hurry to Mount Pyre too! Ah ha ha, Team Magma just- they're so stupid. Anyways. Thanks, thanks to you, we're safe. It might be an odd way of thanking you, but take this Pokemon. Cast form. What? I don't have, but it's... Um... I don't know what I'm gonna name you, to be honest, because I'm probably not gonna use you, but, uh... Hmm... I don't... I don't... I, don't, I have an idea. It's a face! A smiley face, trust me! <laughs> Anyways, yeah, whatever. You're you're telling me that stupid stuff with cast form. I don't care. Okay, people. Well, that's going to be it for today's video. I'm surprised we managed to get the evolution and all, but let's just look at that real quick. Oh, Valen has an item. It is a full heal. Thank you. Look at that. Pure power. Oh, my God. So, people, with that, that's going to be it for today's episode of my Pokemon Theta Emerald Nuzlocke series. If you have enjoyed, go ahead and drop a like as well as comment, and I shall see you guys next time. See you. Sure.